So let's going from values to finally, we're going to talk about purpose. What are the causes and industries that bring meaning to your work? In DC, I think a lot of us get on the, okay, every single thing has to have meaning. Well, sometimes people don't, that your job doesn't have to be a save the world job. And I think sometimes in our area, there is a lot of pressure for that. And sometimes people want that, but that doesn't always have to be the case. Um, like I have a friend of mine who's worked in tons of different companies and her thing, the purpose is she always loves companies that are reinventing themselves. That's her driver. That's her purpose. So I, I don't want people to th always think purpose has to be the save the world. So writing your own introductory speech or being honored. I had a former client did this and he ended up realizing that he and his wife, he wanted to move to a small town. He was business. He wanted to own a small business in a town and make enough money that he could give back into a local community. That's what lit him up for purpose. So it's really doing that. I love that activity. And I'm going to, there's a couple other assessments and then um, meaning buckets is also a, a good one um, to think about, you know, everything you care about in the world and maybe put it in four different buckets. Like, what do you want to learn about? Where do you want to donate money, volunteer or work? Um, and things can end up in multiple buckets. And whenever I talk about this, it always reminds me years ago when I was in college, I had the great fortune of meeting Jane Goodall. The people know Jane Goodall, who, who's worked um, extraordinary work with chimpanzees. And I asked her once, I said, I, once I asked her at this event, I said, how do you not get overwhelmed by everything that's wrong in the world? And she said something to me and I was 22 years old and it stayed with me. She said, you just need to find your piece of it. And it is so powerful because we can't do everything in the entire world if you're somebody who wants to do cause-based work like this, but you have to figure out what's your piece, where your skills best served. Like with me, you know, the project manager war on poverty, great title, but it didn't play to my strengths. And I had to figure out how to, how to shift into a career that moved more into my strengths.